What's going on YouTube? Geosnow right here today with some unexpected news. For those of you waiting for a jailbreak on iOS 15.4.1, 15.3, 15.2 and so on. You probably remember that the Odyssey team announced their child jailbreak coming soon. But this is going to be a jailbreak for 15.0 to 15.1.1. However, if you are on 15.2, 15.3, 15.4 and even 15.4.1, do not feel left behind because there will be apparently a jailbreak for you too. Here on the objective by the sea conference is the Mac security conference, they published the talks which are upcoming. And amongst the security researchers over here, there is Linus Henze. Yes, that Linus Henze, the person who has created Fugu 14, which was an untethered iOS 14 jailbreak that ended up being implemented in Uncover and gave us untethered Uncover on iOS 14.6 and 14.3 and so on, and even gave Uncover 14.8 support. So Fugu 14 was completely open source, you can see it in here on Linus Henze's account, but apparently at this conference they're going to present Fugu 15, the journey to jailbreak iOS 15.4.1. And implicitly 15.4, 15.3.1, 15.3, 15.2.1, you know, all of them below 15.5. So Linus says in here, with the introduction of the new mitigations in iOS 15, especially in 15.2, creating a jailbreak became significantly more difficult. Before, a kernel vulnerability was enough for jailbreaking, but now a pointer authentication code or PPL bypass is required as well. Some people even said that iOS 15.1.1 will be the last version to receive a public jailbreak. In my talk I will show how it's possible to jailbreak 15.4.1 even with all the latest mitigations. I'll describe the vulnerabilities exploited in the Fogo 15 chain and how some of the mitigations introduced in iOS 15.2 can be bypassed. A demo of Fogo 15 will be also shown including an interesting and uncommon way to install Fogo 15 on a device. Now this speaks volumes. They're going to show a demo of the jailbreak is going to work on 15.4.1 and lower and they are also going to show an uncommon and interesting way to install Fugu 15 on the device which presumably is not the normal IPA style. So this is going to be very interesting because last time Fugu was released was Fugu 14, it was implemented in Uncover and people got an untethered jailbreak out of it and support for up to 14.8. So once this gets out, we will be able to update our tools all the way up to 15.4.1. So yes, as it turns out, iOS 15.1.1 will not be the last jailbreak for the public. And it's all thanks to Linus Henze. Yes, the same Linus Henze that released the core trust bug that will probably be used in the Cheo jailbreak. And yes, that same bug that allows you to sign applications forever. So a lot of good stuff came from Linus Henze and I'm so stoked to see what's in store with the Fugu 15. There is a caveat though. The conference will take place on October 6th. So it's going to take a while, a couple of months before we see this research being published. However, we know for sure that we will get something very interesting from this so do not update your device. If you're running 15.4.1 stay where you are. 15.4.1 is no longer signed so you cannot downgrade and 15.5 is unfortunately not included in this, at least not for now. So do not go to 15.5. Do not go to iOS 16 because you will regret it, especially once the jailbreak is out. So yeah, definitely check out here on my website the latest signing status and the latest jailbreaks can be found on the jailbreak downloads page over here. You can find all the information about what's the current and jailbreak and so on, so definitely stay tuned. But yeah, pretty good news. Thank you for watching. I'm Geo Snow, and peace out.